I didn't know. But uh, I was just, I mean, I, I was really, really worried about him. Yes. I don't know, because, uh, because basically I just wanted him a very good, uh, but when he passes away, you know, I just wanted him just a good death or whatever it is. Yeah. Well, I didn't I want him to life. suffer. No. I didn't want him to suffer at all. When I went and met many uh, vet, vets, they said uh, they, he has to go through with the painkillers and all that. So I thought that's the way usually uh, the dogs are being treated for arthritis. I was really worried about this, but by God's grace, I can just say that <laughs> I met. I just saw an article of yours. Then I got the appointment of uh, Juliet. Then it went on, but uh, she just asked me to uh, change the uh, his food uh, pattern and everything. Though it was little difficult in the beginning, then I lo just loved doing his uh, food, the way she asked me to do it. She changed the, the diet really helped uh, with millets, uh, raw meats, and uh, she asked me to give a uh, uh, beef. Uh, uh, mutton, whatever it is, so that uh, the food really helped him, and uh, and uh, then he lost weight. He was an overweight. He lost a few kgs, and uh, I mean, first he used to find it so difficult to get up, I mean, uh, stand up, and not get up actually stand up. The food went inside, and his uh, skin and uh, the everything became uh, normal. Till that, till before that, it was abnormal. I didn't know that actually. But when it came to normal, then he was very fine. And I'm really, really very happy to see him that he can stand up easily, walk. Though there's little limp sometimes when I see it. This happens to every dog. They really come to know that uh, so many people are so unaware of it. We, we, we don't know. Actually, we don't know that the, the, these kinds of food helps the dog to be healthy. Huh? Very, very happy that uh, I met Juliet and uh, she helped me regarding Ro Rocky's uh, uh, thing. Because of him, I met you. <laughs>